everybody, what is going on? It is Dunbar Snack Bar here with NCAA 13. We've got some more Road to Glory here with Teddy Crocker. So this is going to be a tough game. Uh, I know I say that quite a bit, but you can see I'm playing the Florida Gators, and I'm playing in Florida. So that's going to make it even tougher. And if you've been following the career of Teddy Crocker, too, you've seen that there have been a lot of games that have really come down to the wire or you know games that I have lost against teams I really should have beat. So you, you better believe that I'm absolutely nervous about how this game is going to end up. Hopefully we come out with the win. I just got to play smart, run smart. And I think I got a chance at this one. So let's get the game started off right now. So got to go, of course, with the reaction time feature. Just cutting inside here, able to pick up eight yards right there. Second and two. So not a bad run to get the game started off. It's not like I was able to just blow right past everybody and get a touchdown. But at the same time, it's not like I lost five yards either. So I'm definitely going to take this here build upon it and have a successful game all right so of course still second and two gonna run to the left side now and this uh should be enough for me to be able to pick up the first down and that is definitely how this ends up right here 1110 yards on the season gosh i wish i would have gotten one more yard then it would have been all ones but anyway this is not a good run for me so i go to the right then i go to the left then i get a Toss over to the left side again. Now, time to see if I'm going to be able to catch a pass. So I'm wide open right here. Probably could have gotten the first down. Could have juked a little bit rather than throwing an incomplete pass. Should be looking my way. Now, I know the computer's not like me. Uh, the computer doesn't look for the halfback a lot. But, oh well. I, I would expect a few more passes. But that's one I think it was smart not to throw my way. So we got to wait to see what happens. And it looks like, yes! We are going to get a first down right here. So the drive, we still get a chance to keep going with it here. Going to go back to the running game, which is a smart call. I mean, Teddy Crocker, a phenomenal running back here. Even by attributes, I've reached 99 already. And uh, even though I'm doing really good, I still can't run away from him. I lost five yards right there. All right, maybe I will get a chance to get all, or to get 1,111 yards. That'd be cool. Ooh, that one was really close. Off to the right side here. Oh! Able to get past everybody and get into the end zone. Man, what a great one right there. I mean, honestly, that was so close. Because you saw at the beginning of the play, I almost got tackled in the backfield. But no, I turned that one into a touchdown. So a great, great play by Teddy Crocker. Gives me hope here against the defense of Florida. Georgia will be up 7 to nothing here until Florida gets a touchdown themselves. So we're tied at 7. So 4 minutes and 11 seconds in quarter number 2. Ooh, break one tackle. Got past another one here. It was that third defender that uh, knocked me down. The Georgia fans are getting pretty excited about this too, and I think rightfully so. Great pickup by Teddy Crocker. Two great runs in a row. That first drive... Wasn't the greatest until I had that big run. So hopefully we can build on this. Still tied at seven, of course. Four minutes now left in quarter number two. There I go, getting tackled in the backfield. Kind of wish people would have blocked for me, but you know, on some of those blitzes, it's just brilliant. You know, you you probably had that when you played this game where you go ahead and blitz and it's just at the right time. And nobody picks you up, and that's what happened right there. All right, so just waiting to see if I could. Uh, get the pass thrown to me. Intercepted by Florida. All right, so I should have audibled out of that. Or I should have called a different play because as a halfback, I can't audible. But I should have gone with something different other than the pass. But here with less than a minute left in half number one, I'm going to go ahead and accept the fact that we're going to be passing the ball. Not going to be selfish. That one just thrown out of bounds. Honestly, been disappointed with my quarterback just all season long. I mean, one of the reasons why I ask for the ball quite a bit on the ground is because I trust myself a lot more than I trust the quarterback to get things done. But first and 10 now, 40 seconds left. Looks like another pass. I'll just be darting off here on that slant. But, all right, still nothing. If, if the computer honestly took a look at where I was and threw it my way, gosh, things would be pretty good. Of course, right here, I get the reception, finally pick up seven yards and run out of bounds. So 30 seconds left. So this one, just able to blow past everybody on the line, get the first down. 27 seconds left. Teddy Crocker's gotten us in a good position here. We've only got one timeout left. 
So we got to make this play count. Now, we could still go with the hurry-up offense and the no huddle. I think we could score. All right, so just give it to me again here. I'm going to go to the right side this time. Actually, I'm going to flip it back over to the left at the very last moment. Again, another one of those times where I was going to get tackled in the backfield, but able to pick up almost 10 yards right there, second and in inches. This is where we need to go with the no huddle, guys. I know I could be the one calling it, but still. All right. Dang it. Teddy Crocker's down, grabbing the knee. So he's out just for a few plays. Now we're going to start things off here in half number two. Able to get a field goal out of that. So I was able to contribute a little bit. Now I pick up seven yards. I've got 108 yards on the day here. So I've had a pretty successful game, especially when you consider who my opponent is. All right. So another time. Uh, not able to really get past him. I'm able to pick up one yard here, but not what I was hoping for. Third and two. Looks like I should go to the right side. Whew. Luckily, my center picked up that defender. Otherwise, I wouldn't have been able to get the first down, and I still don't pick up that much, but I get the thing that mattered, and that was the first down. So we're still going here. Four minutes, five seconds left in quarter number three. Going to just run outside of everybody. Able to get the first down, and a little bit more here, too. It definitely seems like that Teddy Crocker is a little tired right now. Definitely doesn't have the speed that I usually see with him. Otherwise, I think I might have been able to just run past him. All right. So even though Teddy Crocker is celebrating, I do come out here for a little bit. Third and inches. So they bring me back in when they need me the most. And it's another one of those times here where there wasn't great blocking. But I get those few inches that we need. And we're looking... And a first down, 14 to 10. Georgia down by four, of course. Now I run to the right side. This worked so well for me before and worked pretty well right there. But after that, I get pulled again. And it's just a field goal. That was it. I would hope the computer would keep me in a little bit more here. Finally, after a while, throws my way. Able to break one tackle. Not able to get the first down, though. Almost. Second and inches now. So I better better run the ball right up the middle next. Took me a while to be able to stand there and for the computer to figure out that I am open and I'm the best chance for us to be able to pick up some kind of yardage right there. All right, so Teddy Crocker now with a couple receptions on the day. Second and inches. Going to run over to the right side here, which I think will be a smart call. But again, my blockers fail me. And again, I fail the team too by continuing to just run backwards, hoping that I can get away. Third and four. I got to make up for it right here on the draw play. Fortunately for me, I am able to get the first down. I just fight forward and get that one. So despite the fact that I did not have a good run, I'd say I successfully made up for that one. First and 10. 33 seconds left. Able to get to the sideline here, pick up a few yards, but I am tired again. And come in a little bit later on. 21-13 now is the score. So we're really paying the price for the fact that my team without Teddy Crocker in is not able to finish off these drives. All right. So second and 13 now. Good chance for me to be able to pick up some yards. Able to get eight right there. So we're looking at third and five. This is a huge, huge play coming up right here. Because if I'm not able to convert here on third down... I don't know if we're going to be able to come back here, especially with two minutes and 16 seconds left. So I'm just sitting here waiting to block. So we are able to get the first down. That is good for us. Now we've really got to get uh, the ball moving here. I don't think a running play is the best, but I couldn't choose a passing play here. So I'll make the most of this one. A good pickup here. Second and two now for Teddy Crocker and the Georgia Bulldogs. So at the times that we've needed Teddy Crocker, he's really been able to come through with a big run for us. Nothing, of course, as big as that one play that got me the touchdown earlier, but still. All right, less than two minutes now. Of course, the computer's going to be going with a series of passing plays. I will support this. Looks like that one gets caught. First down. So now with Teddy Crocker, less than a minute and 30. Just try to go forward here to see if I could block, but really nothing's done. Second and eight now. Going with a few uh, receivers deep. Going to keep an eye out for them. Now's the time to throw it. 
But you don't throw it out of bounds. You got to throw it to Teddy Crocker. I don't... Ugh. Absolutely infuriating here with the passing in this game. Just the passing in general. Second and seven. I don't know why you would pick up three yards right there. So, all right. We're just going to have to go with the hurry up offense right here. So, a couple chances there. Luckily, because Teddy Crocker went out to the left side, that got the wide receiver open. Again, we're going with another hurry up. We've got no timeouts left. 15 seconds left. Not going to be good enough here, but that does stop the clock now. So, 12 seconds left. We've got one receiver just going deep. I got to take a look to see what happens with him going to the right side. Picks up three yards. Hurry up offense again. This is going to be it. This is going to be the last play of the game. I'm just going straight out. I don't care what happens. Oh, it's going my way. Teddy Crocker with the catch. Gets into the end zone. 21-19. So what a huge touchdown reception for Teddy Crocker. The one time the computer does look my way. Look what happens. All right, so now it's up to the two-point conversion here. We have to go for it to be able to tie this game up, send it into overtime. So we're going to see what Teddy Crocker does. W wait, you're not putting in Teddy Crocker. you got somebody else in here right now in the biggest moment of the game. Throws it to the right side. Tight end not able to hold on to it. Infuriating. And the Georgia fans are celebrating right now too. This is just messed up. I don't know what's going on, but wow, that's... Well, it was great that I was able to catch that touchdown pass. That was the stupidest thing I have ever seen. Even though Teddy Crocker is tired, I still would have been able to find a way to get that two-point conversion. My gosh. Terrible, terrible job by my team today. Poor coaching. Just all around. Even when Teddy Crocker is a little bit tired, you pull him and we end up losing the game because of it. Anyway, so Teddy Crocker did have a good game, of course, uh, through receiving and also running the ball as well. So I guess I should be celebrating that. But anyway, I'll stop worrying about it here. We'll wait for the next game. Thanks for watching, you guys. I sure do appreciate it. More Teddy Crocker, of course, to come later on. So make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. You can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, all that great jazz. Just make sure you check the description below. But you are phenomenal people. Do not ever forget that. And as always, you guys, I hope you have a good one.